Hey everyone, welcome back again to another Flutter tutorial. And in this session, we will look into one of the popularly used Flutter widgets known as vertical dividers. So whenever we speak of the dividers, the first thing which comes to our mind is the default horizontal divider which we used to have in Flutter. Suppose there is a scenario where you need to separate two Flutter widgets in a horizontal view, then there comes the concept called vertical dividers. So say for example, if you have a list view with the horizontal scroll and if you want to apply divider in between each widgets, then you can go for vertical dividers in that scenario. We have a simple example here where you have two text widgets which are placed in a row wise manner and what we need to do is we need to create a vertical divider in between these two widgets to separate them and for that we can make use of the vertical dividers. In Flutter we have the vertical divider class which by default will create a vertical dividing space in widgets and I guess you can hardly see the vertical divider being rendered here in the UI screen. And this vertical divider also acts a few parameters that's the same what we have for the dividers. The first would be the color. Let me provide the color as grey and the second would be the thickness and I guess now you will be able to now clearly see the vertical divider. Followed by which we have another parameter called the intent which is typically a spacing which you can provide at the top of the divider which is a kind of padding spacing which you can typically apply to provide a spacing at the very top. Similarly if you want to provide some spacing at the bottom of the divider you can make use of another parameter called end intent. So this intent and end intent actually accepts double value so you can make use of any value based upon your choice right so this is all about the vertical divider what we have in flutter so you don't need to install any external package for creating this vertical divider we have the vertical divider class in flutter itself so you can make use of this widget so this vertical divider has now helped us separate these two widgets which is aligned in a horizontal row wise manner similarly if you want to separate two widgets which are placed in a vertical manner then we can go for the horizontal dividers in that case all right so if this is your first time hearing about the vertical dividers, then let me know them in the comments below. For more such awesome Flutter contents and Flutter tutorials, consider subscribing to my YouTube channel. And I will see you again in the next video.